Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I have five minutes here, so excuse me if I go a little quickly. Uh, I thought I would take some time to go over the stainless, the, some of the options on the stainless, the ones I've already made, which is these three. And uh, if I get time, I'll, I'll talk a little bit about the water stone that I used to sharpen them. Um, these are the new AEBL stainless knives. Um, they are, this is a 150 Petty. This will be one of the stock options. Dual taper handle, minimalist spacers. This is this is stock on all of them. This happens to be some Claro Walnut <clears throat> that I have in my extras box. Um, I'm not going nuts on the handle for these knives. They're they're not they're not the price point isn't set up for me to do a lot of custom options or a lot of anything. These are build the knife, put it together, grind it with my full on grind. I mean this is a performance grind. This is exactly what you would get in one of my custom carbons only stainless brushed finish um no 10 hours of hand polishing you know the handle is my top of the line just flare dual taper handle but by not having to put 20 different spacers in there and 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 sand each one by hand down to the proper thickness you know a, a half a millimeter difference in thickness on spacers will change the look and it'll look unbalanced you've really got to be uh, attention to detail is key that takes time the idea in this is an existing metal, existing thickness G10, existing metal, cut the handle once, smooth it out, make sure it's square, you know, put it together, and, and I have a pretty handle that's very, 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 very functional. Uh, you can see the grip is great on these, and the, the people that have them now, the, they'll, they'll attest to that. Um, these knives come very, 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 very sharp. That's where the water stone comes in. I don't know if I will be able to do this in here, because this is a big piece of paper much bigger than I expected, but this is almost flat, as you can see. There's very little curvature to it. And, I mean, that's sharp. I barely lifted that to the, the spine of the knife to get to that point. Um, they're not dull. See, I mean, clean cuts. I'll do it with the I mean, it, it, it takes nothing for these things to cut this paper. Um, the Saya are Kydex over leather. You see leather in there? You can see the seam here. They are very functional. They aren't decorative. They aren't gonna win any beauty contest. That's not what they're for. They're a relatively inexpensive, very protective Saya for a utilitarian knife. Um, they are an extra cost, obviously, but the, they're much more reasonable than the full leather side that I do. This is the paring knife. You can see there. And if you'll notice one thing that I did on the paring knife, this is a 100 millimeter long handle. And as you can see, this is much shorter. And the reason for that is when you're holding a paring knife to, to peel, it's perfect. It barely sticks out, just the tiniest little bit. You've got a lot of leverage on it. It does everything you need it to do. I was actually going to make it shorter uh, down in here, but I decided not to because I still wanted to have the ability to do some board work with it if you have to. Um, so it, it got a compromised length. I, I required the, the shortness, but um, the length, I, I it's as short as it can be and still do board work. It's sharp. Uh, this is the 220. This one is still for sale for $550. Um, it's an extra heavy. That's one of the reasons why. Uh, this thing, let me see here if I can get this to focus. This thing is a beast by comparison. It is incredibly stiff. It is very, very, very sharp. I'm, I'm really, really happy with, AE, with this AEBL. It's taking an edge like my W2 and, and holding it. Um, Waterstone. These are $60 for KKFA Kitchen I4 members, uh, $70 for everybody else that's shipped in the U.S. So, you know, this is another, this is what makes these things do this. Uh, the stone is great. I have 30 seconds left, so my, my camera limits me to five minutes. Um, just a little more detail of the, the Saya. Uh, I'm really happy with these, and, and if you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask me, and... Thank you very much for looking.